just won't be the same. You got to keep working in Jesus' name. Don't you ever, don't you ever go astray. You got to keep on working for the Lord every day. Now don't worry. Try to be strong. Keep toiling on. Keep toiling on. When you're away, I don't know why. Sometimes it's going to get dark at night. But don't you worry, my God will make everything all right. Lately I'm calling on you, hey, every day, just won't be the same. You've got to keep working in Jesus' name. Now don't you ever... go astray. You got to keep on working for the Lord every day. Now don't worry. Try to be strong. Oh, keep talking. Keep toiling on. Storm raging. Keep toiling on. Oh, we know when your way get dark at night. Don't you worry. Jesus will make everything all right. Every day. Just won't be the same. You got to keep working in Jesus' name. Now, don't you never, don't you ever go astray. You got to keep on working for the Lord every day. Now don't you worry.
here today. He's back with us. He has a word from God. Uh, I want you to put your cassette tape into the cassette player. Put your VHS tape into the VCR. All right. If you don't have uh, a VCR, you need to get you need to get the copy of this this broadcast because every time you hear the word of God, you're going to hear something new. All right. The word of God is rich. Amen. Alive. Amen. All right. You're going to receive revelation. You're going to find out that even though you've heard much, there's much more to hear. All right. And I want everybody now to stand for the man of God, Pastor David Wilson. And I want you at home to stand for the word of God. Amen. Let's Amen. stand for the word of God and for the man of God. Give a hand. Praise the Lord. Amen. Glory. Love you, brother. Amen. Praise the Lord. Praise and the Lord. It's a blessing to be here, giving honor to God, the head of my life. My Lord and Savior Jesus Christ, I know that if it was not for the grace of God, that I wouldn't be here tonight. I would not even be on this TV program, this broadcast. I never even dreamed when I started out to be a Christian that I would be on a television broadcast. But I thank God tonight, hallelujah, for, yeah. for, for all of you, and I thank God for, for Apostle Glover and uh, Mr. Howard and for the great work that they're doing here in uh, uh, Stuttgart, Arkansas, and right. reaching the homes of the families and Christians. And I pray to God that you shall be edified this day by the Word of God. Amen. Because without the Word of God, we cannot survive. Right. We have a lot of things that are going on in this world today. Oh, yeah. I tell you, we, we need to get ready, get right with God. Amen. Amen. And do what God called us to do. Amen. 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 If you got your Bibles, those of you at home that are here this afternoon, turn with me to the book of Matthew, the 14th chapter, verse 22 through 29. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. <coughs> Matthew, chapter 14, verse 22. Twenty-nine. When you get it, if you're able, stand to your feet, those of you that are here, and let us reverence the Word of God. I know that you don't have to do it, but if we can stand for the Pledge of Allegiance, if we can stand for the National Anthem, then we ought to be able to stand for the Word of God. All right. Amen. Amen. Matthew chapter 22. I mean 14, I'm sorry, 14. Verse 22 through 29. And the scripture read, And straightway Jesus constrained his disciples to get into a ship and to go before him unto the other side, while he sent the multitude away. And when he had sent the multitude away, he went up into a mountain apart to pray. And when the evening was come, he was there alone. But the ship was not in the midst, was now in the midst of the sea, tossed with waves, for the wind was contrary. And in the fourth watch of the night, Jesus went unto them, walking on the sea. And when the disciples saw him walking on the sea, they were troubled, saying, It is a spirit, and they cried out for fear. But straightway Jesus spake unto them, saying, Be of good cheer, it is I, be not afraid. And Peter answered him and said, Lord, if it be thou, if it be thou, bid me come unto thee on the water. And he said, Come. And when Peter was come down out of the ship, he walked on the water to go to Jesus. Amen. Amen. You may be seated, man. Hallelujah. Praise God. My thought this afternoon, praise God, is this right here. Be, don't be afraid to step into faith. Hallelujah. Praise Amen. God. Amen. Don't be afraid to step into faith. I'm not saying step on faith or step out on faith, but I'm talking about stepping into faith. Amen. Hallelujah. There's a difference. Hallelujah. Amen. Praise God. We see, hallelujah, that in this passage, praise God, Jesus, again, Peter is learning something. He's learning about faith, hallelujah. 
And you know, the world that we're living in today is a troubled world. It's a, it's a troubled time. And people are going through many, many trials. And, and we see nothing good on the news. And, and, and every time we turn around, there's things that are, that are bad. And, and communities are, 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 are not getting along and, and with each other. People are just doing what they want to do. 